Today we are in Osaka, Japan and it's currently night. Tomorrow we're going to the castle Himichi, after that to Arima Onsen and lastly to Mount Rocco. One thing you should consider with this tour is you should bring a jacket because it can get really cool up on the mountain and also on the countryside. Especially if you compare the temperatures in Osaka to the countryside, there's a large difference. Another thing you have to consider is Castle Himeji has a lot of stairs. It's not only going up the hill in Castle Himeji, you also have to walk up the stairs in the castle itself, which are like really steep. So keep this in mind before you do the tour. In Arima Onsen, there are lots of food stands and also souvenir stands. It's like really nice. You have a lot of incense shops and it's a real adventure. From Mount Rocco itself, you have an amazing view over Kobe. So see you tomorrow for the tour.
ありがとうございましたいや、行ったら山、山だ
much. So we are up here at Mount Toroko. And there you have a souvenir shop, you have also a really great view. But just one thing you have to keep in mind is that up here it's like really cold. So like in Osaka city it was today 26 degrees and up here it feels more like 15 degrees Celsius. So if you look behind us, there you can see the city of Kobe, which is famous for the Kobe beef. Okay, everyone, uh, so it's been cold, huh? Everyone, you enjoy the wheel? So we're back in the hotel now and the tour itself was really great. It was very convenient with the tour bus to get from place to place. One thing I should have kept in mind is taking a jacket. Arima Onsen itself is a very pleasant traditional Japanese village where you can have a lot of delicious food. There are also a lot of souvenir shops and of course the onsen there where you can put in your feet. Also they have many tiny back alleys there. At every corner you can find their different food places so it's definitely a good place to get here and there some snacks. Mount Rocco in the end was a really great place to take some pictures at the end and also to get some souvenirs there. Of course when you go by yourself make sure to bring a jacket so you're not cold up there in the mountain and you can walk around and enjoy the view. If you want to book the tour for yourself, go to my description, there's the link, and I also hope you will enjoy it. See you in the next video.